Hey everyone. Okay, so now I've shown you the Enviro cloth and how it works against the Clorox wipes. Um, I wanted to show you another product that comes in the Safe Haven 5 package, which is basically the Enviro cloth, the window cloth, the dusting mitt, laundry detergent, and the cleaning paste. All of the five necessities to get you started with a Norwex clean. So what I did was I took everything off of my mop. This is my mop. And this um, literally picks up everything as well. It's got the finer microfiber. Um, I, it has made mopping so much easier. I just go over it first with my, my dry cloth and then my wet cloth and my floors have never been cleaner or cleaned so fast as well. But what I did was I took a little bit of the mop and I went over my floors and now I'm gonna show you how it cleans this. This was all that was in my dry cloth when I went through my things. And so I'm gonna take this. This works off of static electricity. So what I do before I dust is I usually just rub it between my hands. And then this literally picks up everything. Nothing goes flying at all. 100% clean and it's all stuck in my mitt. Normally I used to use the Swiffer, the Swiffer dusters to clean my fans, to clean my tables, to do all of my dusting. But when I do it, especially the fans, when you go across with the Swiffer, everything at the end falls to the ground. And the same in my bedroom, I have a glass table underneath my TV and I live at the bottom of a canyon and we have our slider doors open at night. So my room gets very, very dusty and the dust on that in one week's time can get that thick. But what happens is with the Swiffer, I would dust it and it would all fall to the ground. Then I'm having to vacuum and then my allergies are acting up. I've noticed in the last two weeks, I haven't even had to take Benadryl at night because my allergies aren't even affected anymore. Um, Claritin in the daytime, Benadryl at night to help with the allergies. And since then, this collects everything. Nothing falls on the ground. It's all stuck in here. So this is another one of my favorite, favorite products is the dusting mitt. And then I guess I will show one other thing I wanted to show you too is the cleaning paste, which is another staple. They call this elbow grease in a jar. And you can use this on just about anything. You can use it on stainless steel, porcelain, tiles. You can get in the grout between your tiles, um, in the showers. My sister used it on her um, faucets and stuff inside the shower and sent me pictures because she polished it right up with this. this. And this is so easy to use. My husband, we had bought a door from Home Depot, but it didn't fit in the door frame that we had. So he had marked it all up because he was going to cut it and put it in. But we were able to fix the door without having to use the new one. So we took, he told me to grab my cleaning paste and just a little swipe of this. And we were able to get all the markings that he had put on the door for him to cut it. And it literally just came right off and without even scrubbing because these microfibers, they have like little fingers in them and they attract everything as well. But I'm gonna show you how that works by, this is a piece of tile, um, just an extra piece of tile I had. It's a little bit, I don't know if you can see it, kind of groovy. And what I'm gonna do is this is a Sharpie marker and I wrote with Sharpie on my tile. I'm telling you guys a little bit of this goes a long way. I've had this since July and I've used it a lot and you can see how much is still left in there, in the jar. The woman who introduced me to Norwex has had hers for two years and still has some left. But I just put a little tiny bit on my cloth and then I'm going to wipe my tile. not even scrubbing or anything and it comes right off and it's all polished. Isn't that crazy? You can use this on tennis shoes. Um, I've gotten so many spots off the doors. I have two teenage boys and dirty fingers and dirty hands and they get messes everywhere and this works amazing with the cleaning paste. I've used it to clean tennis shoes, white tennis shoes, my chucks, the converse, clean the toes right up and they look brand new again. So that was the cleaning paste. And I just wanna thank you all for watching. I hope these videos are helpful for you. 
And um, if you have any questions about Norwex, Norwex, any of the products, um, just let me know. Oh, laundry soap. Here is another one of my favorites. And this also comes in the Safe Haven 5 package. I have had this bag since July. It says it's one pound, 10 ounces, and it has absolutely no fillers. I used to use all free and clear and I get the big Costco size gallons of it. And this one has lasted me longer than the all free and clear has. Um, no irritation on my skin, nothing. I use this and then the dryer balls, which the dryer balls, you can put a little bit of essential oils on them because this has no fragrance as well. So that's where there's no chemicals, no fragrance, no irritations to your skin or anything. And um, a little bit goes a long way with this. I don't even use bleach in my whites at all anymore. I just use a scoop full of this or sometimes not even a scoop full. And here's the scoop right here. And what I also do with this is I mix it with water in a squirt bottle, just like a half a, a half a scoop shake it up and that's what i use to clean my floors i do add a little bit of um, essential oil melaleuca in my um in my floor wash too but i just go around spraying my floor and mopping away and it's so much easier so much better than swiffer because i used to buy the boxes of the swiffer pads the wet ones the dry ones and it would take up so much space in my cupboard or my closet my utility closet that i don't even have that anymore so it, it's been nice my cleaning has improved and changed 100%. Like I said before, I'm not a cleaner. I've always hated to clean, but I don't even mind with this. I've been so excited with every new thing I get. I'm like, I wanna clean, I wanna clean and check it out. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, again, let me know if you have any questions and I'd be happy to answer them. Thank you again, bye.